welcome back to the vlog welcome if you're new if you are new pause the video hit that subscribe button down below so today is october the first um it's a new month it's fall so i'm just gonna be taking you guys along with me and i'm actually headed to work right now it is saturday like i said october the first and i believe it's like 7 15. so i'm about to head to work and i have a few other things that i'm going to do today and I'm just gonna take you guys with me. I did a little updo, not too much on the makeup, but I like it, it's real subtle. So yeah. You guys, it's so cold. I was not prepared for it to be this cold. <clears throat> So you guys, I wanted to be, okay, I think my last vlog, I think I ended it while I was just like yesterday, I was preparing for midterm, um, so I'm going to pick up here, and I still have to study for midterm, midterm is Tuesday, I've already started, but I still have to finish my studying, so today, as I said, I'm about to go to work, um, I'll stop. I'll get off a little bit early so I can go see Ava and my mom at my mom's family day for her job. There's this like Lazy Acres farm and they have like a lot of fun stuff like pumpkin patch and stuff like that. So we're taking Ava to that. Well, my mom is taking Ava and I'll just, you know, go by for her just to show my face and to, you know, to help with whatever with Ava. Um, I like to be a part of stuff like that. And then I'll come home um, and then I'll study and then I'll kind of show you guys how I prepare, like beginning of the month, how I plan out everything. So I'll show you guys that. Um, babe and I may or may not, depending, especially depending on the weather, go out to grab food later. So that's maybe or maybe not. And I'll try to put like a little um, to-do list or checklist over here so I can keep up with it and you guys can you know, ver like, see what I'm saying. Gosh, my mom's gonna be in the seat. Now I think I'm gonna be late. I think I'm gonna drop it by and be late. Alright, you guys. So, yeah, I'm gonna go by my mom's to drop off Ava's seat. And then, I'm gonna head to work. So, I'll see you guys. Alright, so, I got Ava's seat dropped off and I am headed to work. Making really good time. Like today's gonna be a good day. I'm claiming it. Well, you know what? October in general is gonna be a good month. I'm really nervous about my midterm, only because I didn't do what I wanted to do on my first or second test. There it is, and it wasn't horrible grades. It was literally like one question off, but still. And I've been feeling away about it until I was able to pass my third test so and a lot of people will keep telling me like you are doing amazing like that's great and I'm just like I have so much pressure that I put on myself I'm like I want to make this grade I want to make this grade and I'm like I just want to pass at this point like whatever that is I just want to pass y'all nursing is um so different it's like one of those things that like it's just different like test taking is different the way you analyze the test the questions is different um the thinking i mean critical thinking is one thing but first priority that type of thinking like all of these situations could be the correct situation or a situation that you would do but which one of them is like of highest priority and i have learned a lot it's just i'm I, that's one that's been my thing that has taken me the longest to learning um nursing test taking strategies so but i think i'm doing so much better um i actually have like a coach now not really a coach but like uh whatever but 
that's been very beneficial like I even saw improvements just from meeting with her once um but everything is good like I said we are halfway through so I just have to work 10 times harder than I did the first time which I did work really hard and then I know I'll succeed like that's all that's all I can do that is all I can do Someone comment on my, commented on my video that I just posted yesterday and she said, don't beat yourself up if you don't do well on a test. She watched so many YouTube nursing students or whatever, nursing students that are YouTubers, you know what I'm saying. And it's not about when they finish, she says, it's about the fact that they do walk across the stage, they, they finish. And that's what I'm, like I have a goal you know, the program is two years and I'm trying to finish in two years. But I have to remind myself that the, to finish is the goal, whatever that looks like. And I know I compare it to my bachelor's degree because when I was in my bachelor's program, I finished in three years. It was a four-year program and I finished in three years. But granted, I didn't have a kid. I didn't have, like, a family that I was taking care of or, you know, the mom or the girlfriend. for You know what I'm saying? Like, the one that was cooking and and it was just me and it was easier but this is real life and to be honest this is my life now and I love it here so I just gotta you know do what I can um get support when I need it and I'll do well hey guys I am off work it's noon um I am going I'm gonna go by home to change I didn't think I was gonna change I don't know if I'll change I probably won't change but I might change my shoes and then babe happens to be off a little early so he's gonna actually attend the family day with me or with us um, and it'd be so good for us all to be there and I know Ava will love having her mommy and her daddy she loves when her mommy and her daddy is with her because it's all about her and she can just show out and all of that stuff that kids do when their mommy and their daddy is with them i don't know why they just do but yeah. let me put my seatbelt on i'm gonna go home and i will see you guys soon i'm gonna get some footage from the family day so i'll see you guys in just a bit all right guys so i'm home i have changed um just i just have on this little dress a little crossbody bag so i can be comfortable still put on my cardigan because it is still cool outside but um i didn't do anything different with my makeup i redid my lip like lined them and just put on some gloss so yep we're heading out so guys, one of my co-workers had her lashes done and she told me the place, y'all, they look so good. They look like the individual minks, but they were, I, don't, I think they were the cluster minks, like cluster, I don't know, but she told me the place and I really want to go today. Like I really want to go today because I hate putting, these are strips from my lash line lash balia i'm gonna link it in the description box i haven't been promoting it but i am going to link it in the description box for anyone who's interested in shopping my lash line but this is one of the styles that i do sell um i used to sell them heavily but now i've just been like like i still have inventory but i'm not like promoting it i don't know why i just felt like it was i don't know but i definitely need to start back promoting it but these are some of my lashes that i'm wearing but they're strips and I want like individuals that'll last like two or three weeks. So I won't have to like do them in the morning time and that'll save me some time on getting dressed. So I'm really thinking about considering going to get them done today. And if I don't go today, I'm definitely gonna go tomorrow because they look so good. <laughs> and I really want mine done like individually. So I won't have to do them. I really, I really, since I'm waiting on babe, I really could show you guys how I, how I'm going to organize my planner. I can really be doing that while I'm waiting on him, but, um, 
I feel like the moment I get it out and get started, he'll be here and it'll be time to go. So I'm going to wait, but I just wanted to talk to y'all. I'm always talking, but I just wanted to talk to y'all and tell y'all how I was feeling. Um, I'm just going to try to be so transparent and I feel like that, like, it's like, I really don't realize who it may affect, but there's somebody out here who's watching out there, who's watching and my story and the way I turn it around or the way I push through it could influence them. And that's definitely like what I hope to achieve with my channel. Like that is what I'm trying to do. Um, not just share it so people can have insight, but for one, this is something that I like to do. It's something that I'm passionate about. And then if I can like influence someone who may fail a test, to keep going because it gets better, then that's definitely my goal. And I'll feel like I did my purpose. You know what I'm saying? So, as I said earlier, I did not do well on my first test. I did not do horrible, but there's not like a fine line between horrible and good. It's like pass or fail. That's just what nursing is, pass or fail. And I don't care if you pass by one point, pass is pass and fail is fail. And I didn't do well. And I know there's going to be moments where you won't pass every test. I'm just going to say it. I'm going to just be real honest because this test that I just took and I passed, I did so well on it, which brought my average up. And I'm so thankful to God. But there are people in my class who didn't do as well. And it's not like everyone gets a chance to fail. But it's like, it's okay. Especially if those people that was their first time failing or whatever, like it's okay. Just take it in, realize what you missed, look at your strengths and weaknesses and try to improve because you will see the concept again in midterms. You will see the concept again in finals. You will see the knowledge that you didn't quite understand. You will need it again as you progress into like deeper concepts and things like that. So it's like a learning lesson all, all around. Like, you know, it's like, you can learn from this. You can redeem yourself. Like, and that's what I had to learn and I had to know and I had to look at because I started to get really, I don't even know the word, like I <laughs> like discouraged, I guess. There was moments where I was like, I never questioned myself as like if I could do this. I always knew that I was capable of doing it. It was just like why is it not connecting? And then I would go and I would sit in my test review and my instructor would be like, you, you have it. Like you, you can do it. And I know you're going to do it. It's just like you had to learn how to take a nursing test. I, and I, like I told y'all, that was my biggest issue. So I'm so happy that I'm kind of over the hump i'm still working towards being like over the hump and knowing like if you throw something at me i'm like oh, i got that you know i still allow myself to second guess sometimes i still allow little bitty things within the question to kind of trick me up and that is what i'm working to overcome i'm definitely gonna sit down and do a video of what i wish i knew prior to nursing school because there's so much that i'm learning i'm like dang i didn't know this was like this like, nobody told me this, you know? And not that I can tell my story and give anyone a nursing experience, but I can definitely give you insight to nursing tests or to the structure of nursing. Like, somebody somewhere don't know that it consumes your life or that it changes you, you know? And I just want to share that. But today is a great day. Today is an amazing day. And I'm so happy. So um, hopefully we can continue to be this way. Even in the midst of, you know, those moments where, you know, we may face, face difficulties. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm talking too much. So I'm waiting on babe. So I'll see you guys once I'm at Lazy Egg.
showing you my calendar. As you guys can see, September was a very full month for me. Um, and when you look at my calendar, I know you guys see a few different colors. Everything on my calendar is um, color coordinated or color coded. Um, I use the same colors every month. And as you guys can see here, these are my tests. Um, I have them bubbled. I went ahead and put them on there for the entire semester. So each test, those kind of stand out. Um, anything in pink pretty much deals with Ava or something pertaining to her or school. All right, so I got my pins out. Um, my green pin is for bills. My pink one is for Ava. Orange, I'm going to be using for fall. And blue is like special pay dates and things like that. And everything else, just, just general, goes in black. So we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and plan out all my bills for the month. i um, going to put them next to their due date. Um, that way... When I see green, I know that a bill is coming up or I can expect um, a withdrawal from my account and things like that. And that's just how I keep up with that. Yeah, so my planner just has been my saving grace for keeping up and staying on task with things. And I highly advise everyone to get a planner. Hey guys. So I'm off work again. Today is Sunday, October the 2nd. Um, and what I do for work is I am a debt PM, like a drug testing program administrative manager for the Air National Guard. It's through like a third party company. And I've been doing this for about two, a little bit more than two years. So it's just one weekend out of the month. It's nothing that's like demanding. So yeah, that's what I do. Um, I was actually thinking about joining myself a few years ago and I've still thought about it but um right now nursing school is my biggest priority so that's that um so yeah it's still early it's 11 and we're done for the day I'm gonna go home I started studying for my midterm yesterday I feel like I reviewed the clinical judgment um concept pretty good but I still need to go over like communications ethics just little bitty topics like that because if they were to pull a question I want to you know know like um, the principles and the scope and you know different things like that which which are fairly easy but like I said it was some of our first concepts so I kind of wanted to still be fresh for midterm on Tuesday I wanted to go get my lashes done I'm still wearing my strips I wanted to go and get them done yesterday but yesterday ended up being long day with um you know at the lazy acre and then I went home and studied so I kind of don't really feel like it right now I do want to go though I might just try to go tomorrow since Ava will be in school I may just go tomorrow or if I get up in the morning and go to the gym since I'll be at the mall anyway, I can just get my lashes on. I think that's what I may do. But I am heading home. Um, I'm gonna continue to review my um, my categories that I weren't like that I didn't have like strong scores in. None of my scores are horrible, but I'm gonna review the ones that I didn't have like at least an 80 or above on, and just make sure. Um, I have all those down pack. So yeah, and I'm gonna go pick up Ava this afternoon from my mom. So I have to like wash her hair and do all of our Sunday prep stuff to get her ready for the week. And like I said, I'll just be studying for my midterm. That's my biggest priority right now. And I have my dosage comp on Wednesday, the day after my midterm. It's a lot to do. It's like never a moment where I'm like not thinking about what I have to do. Like I always feel like there's something I need to be doing when I'm not doing like nursing stuff. So. Yeah.
Mama. Okay. Yeah, baby. Mommy, mommy. Okay, come on. Baby. I wanna hold you. You wanna hold mommy? I wanna hold you. Mommy, I wanna hold your knee. Mommy, I want you to pick me up. So this is her holding me. Y'all see? She's holding me. No such thing. I'm holding her. She is a maze. You ready to go? Love you. Alright, we are heading out. We've already gave her breakfast. This morning she had cereal, yogurt, and grapes. But we are leaving the house now. I know the dog be eating the grass. I don't know why. Yeah. Dog eating the grass. You're going to have a good day today, okay? I love you. I love you. Oh. Yo. Alright, so I just dropped Ava. The sun is not playing with me today. So I'm trying to keep that down. But yeah, I just dropped Ava off. She was good. She was like, mommy, put on my bag. Like put her backpack on her bag. And I'm like, girl, okay. But she was good. She was hugging me. That's my sweetheart. Like she, y'all, that's my baby. But, um, and she is also spoiled as you guys can see. She's a hot mess. Um, I was debating whether or not I wanted to go to the gym, but I guess I'm gonna go ahead and go. Um, because I have a membership, I pay for it, and it's just like, when you don't use it, it's like, you know, one of those things. So, I feel like that makes me go to the gym, because I have a membership, and if I don't use it, then that's just me. But I kind of want to just do something light today, nothing too crazy. Um, I don't even have my headphones, so... But yeah, I'm gonna do something light in the gym. I don't know what just yet. I really don't even wanna go to the gym. I may just do, I may just walk around our lake. Like we have a lake near the gym. I may just go to the lake. That's what I'm thinking about. It's a beautiful day outside. But I may just go to the lake and walk just to clear my head and get me ready. Cause I wanna go back home and start studying for my midterm. So if I do that, um, go to the gym first then I'll be good I mean not to the gym if I go walk at the lake first my lips are a little bit chapped I'm gonna put some on her So I finished my walk. Um, it was pretty good. It was relaxing. I actually talked to God while I was walking. I prayed. I did some breathing exercises. It was pretty quick. I could have definitely done another lap or two. But um, I just kind of want to get back to things. So that little bit of time that I took to myself was so needed. Um, I found myself often either in class or studying or always being occupied in the moments that I am by myself they're like studying and you know there's never a lot of moments where I'm just like in me like realizing that I'm an individual what I like what I don't like just spending time with me talking to myself you know just caring for Aaliyah 
and I feel like this little bit of um just walk this walk that I did this morning definitely gave me to me time and it was just great it was great um so I, I'm gonna try to do this on the days that I don't have class which is two days out the week so I can at least come here or go to the gym which you know um, and I try to go to the gym after class sometimes, but that hasn't been working out lately because I've been like so busy or so full of like a checklist in my head and I like to get straight to it. So, um, people are watching me, but, um, yeah, so I'm happy that I walk. I feel good. Um, I do need to go by the store to get some things. Ava's class or school is having a fall festival on the 15th. And that'll probably be in a separate vlog because I think I'll end this vlog end of this week. So, yeah, um, each class or age group was supposed to bring different things like two liter drinks, cupcakes, cookies, cakes, things like that. So I'm going to um, go by the store and get her stuff for her, her class. And, um, yeah, I want to get my lashes done because I, I keep talking about these lashes. I want to get them done. But they open up in like 30 minutes. So I'm thinking if I should go by the store and then come back. Alright you guys, so I just downloaded my midterm. I'm just like really nervous because that means that the questions are already freaking made like it's already is what it is like the questions are already thought of thought out oh my gosh nervous y'all wish me so i got a pizza got my package from my house. and i got some juice i got the candy for ava's fall festival for fall festival for school I just got some like m and Dots and Smarties and Tip Thrills, stuff like that. And then I have a few two liters in the car. And you just donate to it because Fall Festival is in like two weeks. So I'm contributing to that. And I try to contribute to their festivities every time. But why are you doing it? That might be way. Everything is yours. Tell tell them what that was. That was a Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse. This is what we got. These jeans look like they're good quality. And then we got a cheetah print. Um, side, like off the shoulder, top. These jeans look like they are so good quality. Like they're heavy. And then I have two like turtleneck tank I mean not tank turtleneck long sleeves so yeah and as you can see I did so today is midterm day um I'm just feeling prayed up say good morning good morning <laughs> say good morning <laughs> uh, this is my sweetheart y'all this is my sweet girl what are you doing? What are you doing, silly? What are you doing, silly butt? I am taking Ava to school. She didn't give me any trouble this morning. She just um, watched her iPad while I did her hair and put her clothes on and lotion and oiled her up. Um, yeah. She went to her pot. She, she did amazing. She just... She let me brush her teeth. She was like, ah, and cheese. She just did so good. And I'm just like, that's the start of a great day. So I'm going to go ahead and drop Ava off and then head to school to get situated for midterms. You guys wish me well. By the time you see this midterm, we'll be already done. But, you know, just <sighs> sending up a prayer. I know I'll do well. I have to believe that. Um, I always have to believe that it's already done, that I'm going to do well. Yep. See you guys later. Hey guys. So I am done with class for today. Midterm went well. Y'all, I'm so happy. 
um i feel really good about it i pray i pray 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 that i did well like really well um i'm hoping for like an a um i do feel really good about it really confident um there are a few maybe one or two that i know not really i can't even say one or two maybe one that i know i may have missed but um other than that like i said i feel really good about it i'm actually going to allow you guys for the sake of me being transparent i'm going to um just do you know let you guys know how i did um just because this is really real i'm not gonna share my grade because that is something that i don't want to do but um just the whole passing sharing that moment with you guys because i know that i'm gonna pass i'll definitely do that on this channel because i want you guys to know that um it is a lot of hard work but moments like passing are worth celebrating and um i just want you guys to know that don't get discouraged um nursing is it's a lot all right guys so i'm at the mall as you guys can see and we're just gonna try this again because i came here yesterday and they were closed so we're just gonna try this again hopefully they're open today and able to do my lashes um it's the beauty bar in the mall if anybody is watching that's from here um i'll let you guys know how they turn out and i just have a clean face with no makeup and yeah and i'm gonna get like medium because obviously i'm i'm in nursing school um but yeah i'm so excited so let's go and we have lashes and they're natural so you guys like don't they're not doing too much they're just really natural um they look good it was quick she was nice i like them one thing though the glue is like very high in fume so i'm kind of waiting on that to settle it's like i smell it so that's other than that i like them they're not irritable and one thing i really like about them she didn't put them on my lash line like they're not like really close to my water line to the point where they're like irritable so they're like on my lashes like there's like a gap i don't know if you guys can see but there's a gap and that makes them more comfortable but i like them and i'm happy and satisfied with them I'm so grateful to God that I did. But I failed my dosage cow comp. Well, my first attempt anyway. And I failed because of a simple conversion. I was going from grams to milligrams. And I know it's like a thousand. But I forgot a zero. Like I put, it was 37 grams. And it's like how many milligrams? And I put 3,700, which would be 37,000 because one gram is a thousand milligrams. I. Hi, mommy. Hi, baby. I got you. I love you. 
Y'all, my mom just came over and brought one because I had a horrible day. So today is probably the last day of this vlog and I just wanted to update you guys from yesterday. Yesterday was by far one of my, I would say worst days maybe, or my most emotional days. Like yesterday I felt everything, like everything that I was going through these past two weeks from studying to being a mom, everything, I'm gonna just be real transparent, I felt it, it was heavy. And I won't say I broke, but yesterday, it was very visible like you know anybody looking at me saw it the tears were there and oh child i'm trying to not cry right now but i just want you guys to know that yesterday i passed my midterm and i'm so grateful to god but yesterday i like i was trying to tell y'all i didn't put a zero on my conversion that is the only thing i got wrong and i'm so grateful that that is the only thing i got wrong but that affected me that affected me. Dang, that's myself over here running across the, the little parking thing. Hey guys. So it is the afternoon. I did not get to finish what I was saying this morning. Um, however, I am just coming on here to end the vlog off. Um, as I was saying, and just to sum it up, yesterday was a day where I had a lot going. I felt the pressure. Um, however, I took some time to myself. Um, I'm grateful for my support system. People like my mom, just being a listening ear, um, being there to tell me you got this in moments where I know I got it, but I feel, you know, feel, feel it all, feel everything. I feel every responsibility. I feel every, I feel the pressure of school and, you know, but at the, in times like those, my goal is still at the back of my head. My goal is still it's clear, you know? It's the reason why I keep going. My child is the reason why I keep going. And I just wanna let you guys know, if you are ever going through a moment where it's heavy, it is okay to cry. It's okay to feel frustrated. It's okay to sit in that moment and know that everything that you're going through is demanding. It's okay to say things like that. Like, there is so much required of me. But at the end of the day, I do believe this and I know this and I hold this to be true. Like I said, God will not bring you to anything. He will not bring you through. And I believe that. So I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, I'm definitely going to end the vlog here and then I'm going to just pick up next week. I love you guys and I thank you guys for watching. And if you are not already subscribed, what are you doing? Subscribe to my channel. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment. Um, and again, thanks for being a part of this journey with me.